In movies, we often see guns that are not real, either because they are made up for the movie or because the story requires it. These fictional guns are most commonly found in science fiction and fantasy movies, but they also appear in action films. Some of these movie prop guns have fantastical abilities that only exist in the movies. Here are some of the most memorable fictional guns from movies that I have come across. The M41A Pulse Rifle is a standard-issue weapon used by the United States Colonial Marine Corps. It is a rifle with a 99-round magazine that fires 10mm caseless armor-piercing ammunition. The rifle also features a pump-action 30mm grenade launcher mounted under the barrel. The main gun is actually a World War II-era M1A1 Thompson submachine gun, with a chopped-down pump shotgun serving as the grenade launcher. Another impressive gun in the movie is the M56 smart gun, carried by two marines and functioning as machine guns for the platoon. These heavy guns were built from a World War II relic, specifically a German MG42 machine gun with the grip and stock removed. The guns are meant to have assisted targeting technology using a targeting eyepiece linked to the gun's robotic harness. The robotic harness is actually a Steadicam harness and arm with some added pieces, and the eyepieces are simple props based on Fleur eyepieces used by USAH-64 Apache helicopter pilots. This gun, known as OL, painless in the movie Predator, is a heavily modified General Electric M134 minigun in 7.62 NATO, typically mounted to helicopters and planes. Pieces were added to make it look like it could be fired from the hip, but in reality, the recoil would drive an actor backwards. The gun feeds from an ammunition box attached to create a backpack. Even with blanks and a reduced rate of fire, a large support frame had to be built for the actor to lean against. The M134 is electrically powered, so power cables and batteries were required for on-screen use. It was also briefly used in the movie Scrooged and in Terminator 2, Judgment Day, with some changes to the prop parts. One of the most iconic prop weapons in science fiction history is actually a real firearm. Han Solo carries his signature blaster in multiple Star Wars movies, including The Force Awakens. Officially known as the DL-44 Blaster Pistol, it could be fitted with a stock and an extended barrel for use as a sniper rifle. In real life, the guns for the original Star Wars film were all World War I and World War II surplus European firearms. The DL-44 started out as a Mauser C-96 broom handle pistol, with filmmakers adding custom modifications to give it a more sci-fi look. The Live Fire C-96 used by Harrison Ford in A New Hope was actually used on screen by Frank Sinatra in The Naked Runner. In the comics, Judge Dredd and the other street judges carry the Logiver II pistol as their primary firearm, which can fire in different modes selected by voice commands. In the first movie adaptation, Sylvester Stallone plays Judge Dredd and the Logiver II is a 9mm handgun in a futuristic case with various lights and meters. It has different firing modes including rapid fire, armor piercing, grenade launcher, signal flare, and a double whammy that fires two rounds simultaneously at separate targets. The gun has a security feature that scans the user's DNA and tags each projectile with the user's DNA signature. In the second adaptation, the hero is played by Carl Urban and the Logiver MK-2 has a more realistic look with a digital display showing firing mode and ammunition type. The firing modes include rapid fire, armor piercing, incendiary rounds, stun, hot shot, high explosive, and silencer mode. The guns are coded to an individual judge's DNA and self-destruct if someone else tries to use it. In Constantine, 
John breaks out a holy shotgun for the final act showdown, constructed of holy relics and firing blessed gold rifled slugs, with a dragon's breath flamethrower mounted beneath the barrel. It also features a detachable rotatory drum magazine. Although it looks like a rotatory shotgun, it's actually a pure prop. Now, the Ghostbusters main tool is the Proton Pack, a backpack-sized particle accelerator that fires a stream of highly focused radially polarized protons to electrostatically trap the negatively charged energy of a ghost, essentially turning the proton stream into a lasso. When the stream is fired at things other than ghosts, it has a tendency to destroy them and set what remains on fire. Essentially, it's a handheld wand-looking blaster attached to the Proton Pack backpack.